This morning, safety is top of mind for so many parents across Metro Atlanta after two separate shootings on school campuses. It prompted a gathering of parents at McEachern High School, the scene of a shooting just two weeks ago. 11 Alive's Jerry Karn is, is joining us outside the school this morning. Jerry, those parents are offering some solutions of their own. That's right, Aisha. Good morning. The gathering here was the second in a series of town hall meetings following the shooting here on campus two weeks ago. The first time around, parents expressed anger and outrage. Now they're offering ideas on better ways to protect their children. An eruption of gunfire in a school parking lot. It's something that's still on the minds of Benjamin and Sharon Carter, parents of a ninth grader at McEachern High School. We're married to this community. We're married to this school. We need to know what's going on, and we want to keep it safe. They are among the parents who gather, demanding action. Two people hit, two people hit. In light of the recent shooting that injured two people here, Benjamin Carter has questions about priorities. At the same time, when around when the shooting had happened, that there was a, a new baseball diamond at uh, McEachern. I love that, but when you talk about safety, I could care less about a baseball diamond. Parents are suggesting better security at school entrances that includes facial recognition. They want a vulnerability assessment and more school resource officers. Being proactive versus being reactive, that's what I want. Cobb County School Board member Trey Hutchins organized this meeting. He's promised that the ideas discussed here will lead to action. They've given a lot of great information on next steps and how we can move forward. I'm going to present it to the Board of Education. Benjamin and Sharon Carter are watching, insisting that Cobb County place more emphasis on school safety, motivated by the violence that took place too close to home. I want my son, I want all of these kids to be safe. A board member Trey Hutchins is encouraging parents to gather once again when the full school board meets in two weeks. Back to you. All right, Jerry, thanks so much.